Hey everyone, I'm here to ask you, are you saying thank you? Hey y'all, I'm Steve from Avenger RV Adventure, and I'm here to ask you, are you saying thank you to the people who need to be thanked? People like our military. Our military fight overseas for us, we've come to expect it for years. They defend our country and they do it honorably. But now they're on our land and they're fighting for people who are fighting a virus. Not only are they transporting people who are potentially sick, but they're also building medical units so that people can seek treatment. You have people like law enforcement. Law enforcement facing people every day. Generally, they don't ask questions about whether you got a bug or not. If you see them out, offer to buy them a cup of coffee. Offer to buy their lunch. Buy a sandwich tray and have it sent to whatever local headquarters you have near you. You also have the fire department and EMS. When they come out to a scene, they're generally not asking questions about whether you got a bug and, ooh, I can't touch you. No, they're there to try and treat you. Now, if it's not something that's major, yeah, they may be asking you, have you been sick? Have you been out of the country? Have you been dealing with anybody who's been out of the country? Or anything like that. But they're there for you all the time. So a simple thank you to them. Send them a box of donuts. Send them some sandwiches. Do something just to say thank you. Let them know that they're appreciated. They're out there seeing stuff that you and I don't want to see on a daily basis. And I'm sure it's got to get to them pretty bad. If you know any friends that, have, that are doctors, nurses, they're coming face to face with these people with viruses. I'm sure that they could use a little pat in the back and a big thank you. Who cleans up after these people after they left? Housekeeping. Whether it be out of business, where somebody has come in that is sick, or at the hospital, doctor's office, it's housekeeping. They're the ones who come in and they sanitize the area so that we can go back into those areas. You've got restaurants. Restaurants are going to be going out of business if we don't support them. So order some takeout food. Give them a big tip. If they have gift cards, buy some gift cards so you can buy some food later using those gift cards. Anything we can do to try and keep our favorite restaurants in business will help all of us in the long run. People from the banks. Now, in some places, they may just have drive throughs open, but still, those people are handling money all day long. So the spores from the virus can be on that cash just as easy as a check or anything else. So if you go through a drive through tell them, hey, listen, thanks for being here. Thanks for being open. Postal service, UPS, FedEx, and especially truck drivers. These people are making sure that we get the things that we order on a daily basis. They're making sure that the stores are full stocked so that we can buy the things that we need to take them home, and then stock our shelves at home. And right now, it's been pretty crazy with trying to get some stuff in some areas. I'm sure we're all aware of how difficult it is to get toilet paper these days. How about your gas station attendant? You don't think they just sit in there and take your money. No, they make sure that there's gas for the pumps. They make sure that there's coffee. That's a big thing. Cigarettes. And all the other little things that we run in to try and grab because we're in a hurry these days. How about your grocery stores? The people in the grocery stores are busting their butts trying to make sure that the things that you want are on the shelves. So if you go to a grocery store, tell them, hey, thanks for being open and thanks for being here. I'm sure they'll really appreciate it. Now here's the big thing. TV radio, internet. What would we do right now if we didn't have any of these things? 
you'd have to sit and talk to your family. Ooh. So, if you come across these folks, say thank you. Heck, hit them up on Facebook. Hit them up on Twitter. Say, hey, thanks for being out there. And you also have people like your pharmacy. The people in the pharmacies are facing sick people all day long. I'm sure that they would appreciate a thank you. If you like this video, then hit the like button, subscribe, and ring that bell. Don't forget to share this video with your friends, because they might want to thank someone too. If you're one of the people that's on this list, then from my family to yours, I thank you very much. I wish everybody to be safe, and we'll all get through this together.